Hello scholars and welcome back to Art Online with Ms. Haynes. Malala Yousafzai is a woman's and children's rights activist. As a young teenager, she stood up against the Taliban who tried to ban her right to education. Because of this, the Taliban hurt Malala really bad. But she recovered and still continues today to fight for women's and children's rights. Let's draw this powerful woman right now. All right, let's start with the shape of the face for Malala. After we do the shape of the face, we're going to go ahead and close off the top of her head. Just like that. And now we're going to work on her hairline. We're just going to curve around on one side. And then we're going to do the same to the other side. Now we're going to draw her eyebrows. Can I just say I love Malala's eyebrows. She has really nice, thick and full eyebrows. So we're going to go back and we're actually going to thicken this up just by going down and up. And we're going to do the same thing to the other side to give the full effect of her beautiful eyebrows. And now for her eyes, we're going to have some fun. We're going to go up with a slanted motion and we're going to do the same thing for the other eye. Now we're just drawing a simple circle underneath both lines we just drew for her eyes. And there we have it. Now we're going up both sides twice with lines for her lashes. And then I'm actually going to curve up on the ends as well. Now her eyes are sparkling. Now let's work on her nose. We're going down and we swoop. And then on the other side we're doing a nice little curve line. There we go. Now, let's give her a nice, big, bold, beautiful smile. So I'm just curving. There we go. And then let's add those cheek lines that we love to add so much. Oh, there it is. And now I am doing a swivel at the top for her top lip and a curve underneath for her bottom lip. All right, and now we have our beautiful face. I am just coloring in so you can see more of the full effect of how our girl is looking right now. Now we're going to work on her awesome head scarf. I put my hand below and I make a mark so I can see where I want to start my head scarf. And then I'm actually going to grab some paper to make sure that it stops at the same point on the other side. Feel free to follow these steps or you just can wing it. I believe in you. I have full faith that you can do it either way. And now we're just going to start with a nice arch from where we made our points. And we're going to end where we made our points. So I'm making a nice arch around her head. And we have the top of her head scarf. And now I'm just curving on the bottom. I'm going to curve twice to create some layers for her head scarf. It's looking nice. And now let's go ahead and create those lines to give her her arms. And now we're going to take it up a notch. We're just going to do another curved line to really give her headscarf some detail, some depth to it. All right, and now I am designing it with a few little loops underneath the bottom. Feel free to design her headscarf any way you want to. There's so many beautiful things that you can do to this headscarf. And now I'm adding a book because remember, they want to stop her from getting her education. And we know that reading is knowledge. Now you can put whatever you want on your book. I just wrote an M for Malala. In my background, I'm adding some nice different line styles. Swirling around. And you can do whatever you want to your background. I just feel like this would have been really beautiful behind her. To give the feeling and vibe I want for my picture. But do whatever you want for your background. And now I thought to go back. Let me add some more details to this head scarf. So I'm going back and I'm adding some more line work to it. The more line work you guys, the better for me always. It just makes it pop even more. So whatever I did to that top part, I'm just doing to the bottom. And then I'm going to add one more thing, one more detail inside, which is some more lines going horizontal now. And then I'll have the finished look that I want to her. And there you have it. I encourage you to 
add as much detail as you want to this drawing really make it represent malala and your artistry all right thank you so much for drawing with me today art friends and don't forget to subscribe bye bye